Hello everyone. Today, Automation Việt Nam would like to introduce a new function upgrade for the Smarton 2, Smarton Eco, and Smart FI2. This function is renew ECM for Yamaha T Max or Yamaha MT09 with ECM part numbers B7M, BBW, and BBV. If you would like to upgrade this function on your Smartun 2, Smartun Eco, or Smart FI2, please contact AutoShop Vietnam via our WhatsApp hotline. The upgrade for this function will be done online and it will incur a fee. Please note that this function can only be upgraded on the device that already have the smart key programming function for Yamaha T-Max. Specifically for Smartphone 2, it supports version M or M+, and must be a Smartphone 2 with a 7-digit serial number. Smartphone Eco support for version W or W+. Smart FI2 also need the version with Tmax function. Now I will demonstrate this function on an ECM with the part number B7M. On the table, I currently have an SCU, an ESL and a FOB that have been synchronized with each other beforehand. They are all original from the motorcycle. Suppose the original ECM of the motorcycle is locked or faulty. And now I want to reuse an ECM from another motorcycle for my current motorcycle. In this case, I need to renew that ECM. First, I will test the synchronization between the SEU and the ECM using a custom made cable like this. This cable simulates the smart key system on the bike. Supply power for the cable. The green button is the bike start button. As you can see here, when I press the start button, the power light turns on. And the smart key light blinks four times. That means the SAU and the ECM are not yet synchronized. Sure that this is correct because the ECM is currently used for another bike. Now I will use the Smarton 2 to renew this ECM. You can also perform similar operations with the Smarton Eco or Smart FI2. You need to prepare a multicolor cable and an adapter. You need to open the ECM at this position and shoulder the multicolor cable according to the diagram instructions on the Omoto application. Supply power for the device. Connect the adapter to the device and connect the cable to the adapter. On the smart tool, select smart key. Yamaha T-Max SAU 18 pins Renew ECM B7M Renew ECM EMO Renew ECM success. Now I will check the synchronization between the SEU and ECM on the test cable. First, you need to supply power for the ECM according to the diagram instruction on the Omoto app. In case the ECM and SEU are synchronized, when you press the start button for the first time, you will see the smart key light blink twice 
and then turn off. After pressing the second time, the smart key light will turn on and then turn off completely. This means the ECM and SCU have been successfully synchronized. Thank you for watching the video. Goodbye and see you next time.